magic surprise party is nearly upon us. Party is prepped and everyone did their part and I'm not even <laughs> stressing about it. <laughs> that Parker guy is chatty, but he worked fast and made the time fly. Well, that's great. That is good to hear. Oh, it's nearly time. Head to the party, wait with the others. I'll bring magic, you yell surprise when we walk in and then the party is on. I will head there now. Surprise! Oh my, what a surprise. Happy birthday? I had no idea. <laughs> She's lying. She's lying. We're gonna mingle. Hmm. What a delightful distraction. Though I find my work at the forge invigorating, the occasional entertainment prevents burning out. It is good to take a break when you can. Oh, I meant literal burning. From the inside out, one of the hazards of manipulating Hellfire. This all came together nicely. I know, and I totally Are didn't you blow surprised? it. Somewhat. Nico's plans get ahead of her at times, but this is—it's quite pleasant. From everything I'd heard about the Abbey, I hadn't expected it to be so festive. What did you hear? Just the basics from Tony and Carol. They made it sound like a wayward home for troubled youths. Do you believe that? So far, I see heroes throwing a birthday party for one of their teammates. It's what the Avengers used to do before we got so busy. <laughs> Treasure these moments. They'll keep you going when times are tough. You got it, Steve. I prefer smaller parties. My last birthday had 2,000 guests. How do you know thousands of people? I wouldn't say I know them. Most of them are business flunkies, glad handers, general hangers on. Half the night I'm shaking hands and managing expectations. I spend so much time as Mr. Stark, I'm lucky if I get to be Tony. That's fair. Ooh, nice. Those people are nothing to you. Why coddle them? You have a point. Doesn't always need to be so sharp. <laughs> the, the point. I haven't been to a surprise party in you. The point doesn't need to be so sharp. a while since we've been able to let loose. The Avengers, you mean? Yeah. We've been busy. We see far too much of each other, and yet nowhere near enough. I can't stop thinking about Bruce. I want to hate him for what he did, but I keep wondering if this was our fault. He always gets into trouble when he's alone. Did we blow him off? Did he reach out, but we missed it? I don't know. Yes, that might be what happened. Do not let it happen with the others. Yeah, I'm not always the best with interpersonal stuff. Doesn't mean I can't get better at it. <sighs> Enough of my moping. I'm going to enjoy this party. I suggest you do the same. I love how she's got like the weird basic wonder bread. We're go for cake, right? Yeah, let's do cake instead. Soon. And save some for the rest of us. No promises. <laughs> This is great. I wish the other heroes did stuff like this. Celebrate birthdays? Yeah. I guess it's difficult when you don't know each other's real names, or actual birthdays, which would completely invalidate our secret identities. But why are we talking about this when there's cake to cut? I know I... You know what they call this? The calm before the storm. What makes you say that? Just a feeling. Bladen is foreshadowing. This party was a great idea. Maybe it'll cheer up the Avengers. You think so? It's a party, right? I hope it helps them feel at home. Excuse me. It's too much. <laughs> what is wrong? You said this party would be small. Well, that is what Nico told me. This seems more elaborate than what she described. Then you are blameless. Hunter. This is worse than I expected. Not so bad. But I shall withstand it. You'll be fine. Who else can I mingle with? Is Charlie at the party? Is Charlie's in here somewhere. Oh, Who's my Charlie girl? 
All right. Just me, or is Magic not having a good time? I heard Magic does not like surprises. No, that can't be it. We're friends. I'd know if that was true, right? I don't get it. Everyone loves surprise birthday parties. I should know. I missed out on a few when I was on the run. Why are you so concerned? Wanda is gone. Bruce Banner is fighting for the other team, and the world's going to actual hell if we don't stop it. A birthday party is a good way to lift everyone's spirits. I'm sure we can fix this. You mind letting her know it's time to cut the cake? Sure. Okay. I'll be right there. Whoa! Is there a freaking cat in here? I heard it. It's opposite magic. It's so sneaky. Okay, hold on. So it's gotta be... Oh, there she is. Can I pet her? Nice! Did it not do anything? There we go. Aw, who is a good kitty? I love that. I think that's such a cool... animation. Knowledge and keys, thank you. What? Are you all right? No, this is too much. It is all Nico's fault. And here she comes to fish for praise. I have endured enough of this. This has gone on long enough. You made me the center of attention I do not need at a party I did not want. So what do you want now? To cut the cake? Magic, wait, fine. I will cut the cake. Super pissed. Uh oh. Happy birthday? <laughs> so, uh, cool party? Liliana's my friend. How could I have missed this? Yep, it's all your fault. You should not blame yourself. Then why not? If I paid attention to what she wanted, I wouldn't have driven her away. I want to fix this, but I, I can't follow her to limbo. Although, maybe you could? Hmm. You just said there is no way to get there. No, I said I couldn't follow her. Not when she's mad at me. Limbo adapts to her subconscious. It might treat me as a threat. Oh, cool. What about me? You won't be in danger. She likes you, in her own way. Fine. I will do this. How does it work? The Staff of One can bring you close to her. When you find her, could you talk to her? Make sure she's alright? That's all I care about. What is the best way to approach magic? I feel like I'm the last person you should ask. I'm sure the others have some advice. Is this a one-way trip? It shouldn't be. Once you find magic, she can open a portal to send you back. Hopefully, both of you. How different will this be from our usual trips through Limbo? I know as much as you do. The landscapes might be trippier than usual. All right. Send me after magic. Okay. Here goes nothing. When blood is shed, let the staff of one emerge. Yikes. Was it me? Did I mess up? <laughs> I messed up, didn't I? Yeah. It is all your fault. Really? She called you a Russian word. Sounded like try hard? 
Jeez. That's not Russian. I knew I needed to ease back. I just don't want to be another unexpected roommate for the Midnight Suns. Well, I don't know her at all, but she seems really cool. And it's still a party until I hear otherwise. If you think it'll help, tell her I'll stick around. Okay, well, everyone's gonna have their opinions. Thanks for doing this. Any questions, or are you ready to go? No, I think we're ready. I need a moment. I want to see what the others have to say. Can't hurt to ask. Tell me when you're ready. Maybe I'll ask Caretaker. I was afraid this would happen. I will bring her back. I know. When you find her, make sure she knows the Abbey will always be a home to her. Cool. Hey, what? Oh wait, oh, nice. Who are you? She detects me. You made a wish, and I well, who the hell is this? Wishes. Tell me, why does your heart ache? They forgot. Today is my, my. Oh, sweetly, your birthday. What an awful way to learn what your family truly thinks of you. They don't love me. Nobody does. I can bring you to a magical kingdom. Make you its Who's this voice? Why is he like this? Domain. But you have to wish it so. I could never be as special as a queen. Now, now. That's a lie your family will tell you. I happen to know you're a very special girl. Before we go, I have a question. Of course. Ask me anything, my queen. Are... are you a monster? Oh, child, I'm so much more than that. I'm a friend. The only one you'll ever need. Huh. I feel like that's not the last time we're going to hear that guy. But I really want to know who he is. If he's real or if this is all just a thing that she's created. What is this place? This is so sketch. Huh. Hello. Cursed effigy. Apply a vulnerable end mark to all Hydra? Wow. One vulnerable and one mark to all Hydra. That's ridiculous. That's so cool. Hunter, what are you doing here? Oh, hi. Oh, you know. I just, you know, was chilling. It is not possible to enter Limbo without my knowing. How did you get here? Nico used the Staff of One. Of course. And why did she not come herself? She thought it would make things worse. Well, that makes two of us. Wait, if you found your way to this place, what did you hear? Hmm. Let's be honest. I will never share what I heard with anyone. That is a kindness. You must understand, it is my deepest shame. What is it? The creature you heard brought me here. But my childish needs cursed me to this terrible place. I lost my childhood to one bad choice. I trusted a silver tongue instead of my own family. Okay. I want to know who did this to you. I did this to myself. 
The creature held no power over me, until I allowed it. This day is an anniversary of my weakness. Nothing more. Who you were does not matter. It is who you become that counts. I would dismiss such words from anyone else. But you, of all people, would know this to be true. <sighs> I should stay here this evening. I can endure the stares and whispers, but not tonight. We could hang out here if you want. I... I oh, would cool. like that. I thought you might want to be alone, but... That's really cool. Do you like the music? I do. Hmm. Good. <laughs> Why do you ask? This was the only music I had for so long. I found it in limbo. Trash, discarded by the universe. Is that normal? How can trash get to limbo? All forgotten things can find their way here. Even music, and the means to play it. Even now, I only listen at meaningful times, when I wish to remember the moment. There are more of those now, but not enough to outweigh the days I want to forget. Hunter, can we stay here for a time? Listen to the music? Absolute. Of course. <laughs> Good. Oh, nice. Um, okay. A perfect accompaniment to quiet meditation. We're not doing meditating. This is for Strange. This is for Strange. This is for Nico. Captain America. <laughs> Give her a goblet. That's too bad. Hunter, you have excellent taste. I mean, I could have done better. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I am growing to like you, Hunter. Could you tell me about the creature you mentioned? Something I hope you never have the misfortune to meet. I can say no more. Why not? It hears when you speak its name. Is this just like her inner... I refuse to give it this satisfaction. ...kind of dark thoughts? What happened to it? An eviction of sorts. A permanent one? That is my hope. Why does this look like your room in the Abbey? It doesn't. My room in the Abbey looks like this one. For years, this was the only place in Limbo where I was safe. Where I felt at home. The creature said many strange things about you. How much was true? None. All hmm. were lies to manipulate a stupid child. The creature brought me here to rule this place, but not as I do now. It desired a servant. Loyal, unthinking. A stupid child who believed its lies. I took great pleasure in disappointing it. I should get going. I will open a portal for you. Good night, Magic. See you, Hunter. I wonder if we're going back there ever. You were gone for so long. Did you find magic? I did. She is going to spend the night in limbo. Is she doing all right? Is she mad at me? No, she's cool. She is fine. We had a lot of fun. You did? <laughs> yeah, we listened to music in limbo. Achievement unlocked, I guess. At least her birthday ended on a high note. Oh, that's, that's nice. all that matters. I can't thank you enough for doing this. Don't know how this would have ended without you. Good night, Hunter. Good night, Nico.
Okay. Balance collar. Rare collar. Play two. What did we get that from? I wonder. Okay. Play two hunter cards. Oh. Draw two hunter cards when you play three power cards in combat. That's definitely not going to work for us because we are very dark hunter heavy. Uh, I like this Renegade Caller. The, the card being free is pretty good, but I do think that getting the double damage card is easier and we can trigger it more frequently. I don't know. Like, it's kind of interesting how it's you only need to play three cards for double damage, but you play five cards to get a free one. So that triggers less frequently. This would trigger more frequently. I'm going to switch back to it, and we'll we'll think about experimenting with that a little bit more. Uh, I'm at 67 darkness now. Okay. Let's rest. We're just going to sleep in our sick leather pants. Whoa. Okay. Hunter. You want me to jump off the cliff? That's spooky. Never know what's gonna happen when you go to sleep in the abbey. <laughs> Sorry, dear. Hope I didn't startle you. Coming in fast and hot here. Hunter. You saw her, didn't you? Wanda. What does she want? What we all want. To be found. What if that is not the real Wanda? What if my mother is using her image to manipulate us? What does your gut tell you, Hunter? Does it tell you she was real? I mean, to be fair... Yes, it does. We always see our mother in our sleep, so... Then listen to that. I know you didn't know Wanda, but I did. She's family, Hunter. We cannot leave her behind. Besides, we can't win this battle against your mother without her. So find her, Hunter. Bring her back. For all our sakes. Huh. What are you doing here, Hunter? Oh, I don't know, we just... need to find the Midnight Suns. Just waking up? Wanda. And you need to do it now. Okay. Magic wants to talk first. Will you join me? Yes. Uh, wait. Actually, hold on. Let me see if I can get a gift or something. Because that's going to be our little friendship redemption. Hmm. Dealing with difficult co-workers. Unexpected circumstances throw you together with unexpected co-workers. It's going to be tough to find common ground. This book's for anyone dealing with new difficult co-workers. Interesting. I want to share something with you. Something I have never shared with another. Magic, I... When I was at Professor Xavier's school, I would listen to this album in my room all the time. So she's the all about the music. Sometimes for many days straight. After your time in limbo, music must have been a revelation. It was a lifeline, but it made me no friends. I prefer to listen in solitude, as I always have. You are not alone now. Good, you noticed. The others would not understand. But I know you will, as we both have so much in common. I suppose we are kindred spirits in a way. Of course. We are both children of darkness who escaped our destinies and decided to forge new ones. We are both reformed, trying to be good guys now, even if we do not always succeed. It's nice to have someone to relate with. It is, is it not? Okay, enough talking. Let's listen to the album now. The second hour is when it really gets good. <laughs> oh, cool. Second hour. Okay, so, um, I don't know why I was thinking I would give her a gift here, but, uh, 10% chance now. 
to generate a limbo portal card after an enemy is knocked back through a portal. So this helps us to keep portal cards coming. It's only 10% chance. I believe her second level is a 20% chance. Got the Daughter of Limbo common palette and we hit Team Friendship 4. So now an additional gift is available in the purchase in the shop each day, which is nice, but I wish I would have not bought that one. Good girl, Charlie. Come with me. Where would they be? Do we have a marker? Oh, they're in the war room. And actually... Oh, okay. Hydra forces have taken the Sanctum, Tower, and most of the best retail outlets in Manhattan. They keep making moves. About time we did the same. Our intel points to Lilith being in the Sanctum. That's where we need to strike. Been there, done that. Wasn't our finest hour. <laughs> that symbiote shell has withstood everything we've thrown at it. Lilith chose Venom for good reason. Don't forget about Bruce. Never. Look, the Avengers were formed for good reason. And I'm assuming the Suns were too. I haven't seen a threat yet this group can't overcome. So we can put our heads together. Find a way to do the impossible. Or, we could just wait for Hydra to come knocking on our doors. I don't know about you, but I don't like playing defense. So I say to hell with Lilith and her pet symbiote monster. Let's take the Sanctum back. Ah, uh, I've missed these little talks. Yeah, okay. I'm slightly convinced. <laughs> Guess it couldn't hurt to talk with Professor Von Spooky. See if we can't come up with something together. Now that is the definition of impossible. Let us know if you come up with any ideas. In the meantime, I for one would enjoy getting a little payback on Hydra. Okay. Well, we still don't know where the Midnight Suns Hunter, are. Hey, talk to me. Everything all right, caretaker? That's what I wanted to ask you. You seem distracted lately. Not quite yourself. I feel like something must be going on with you. And I wish you'd tell me what. I am not the one who is distracted. Excuse me? Ever since the fall of the Avengers Tower, you have seemed overwhelmed. Well, it was quite a blow to our forces. If I've been distracted, it's been for a good reason. Speaking of seeming distracted, have you seen any of the Suns? No, but I need to know I where they're not. at. They're all conspicuously missing this morning. Probably off somewhere complaining about me, no doubt. If you see any of them, please ask them to come see me. There is something I'd like to talk to them about. Okay, okay. Huh. They're all, are they like hiding? Hey, Hunter. Have you seen any of the Midnight Suns? I need to speak to them. I think I overheard Blade talking about how he was going to the chapel, which is weird. I didn't think vampires could go into churches or chapels or whatever. See what I know about the supernatural. Hope he doesn't think Carol is gonna meet him there. <laughs> Thank you, Peter. No problemo. Hope you find them. Nice shirt. Keep up the good work. It is a spell of sorts. That is what Agatha used to say, anyway. What sort? The dark sort? A discernment spell. Well, more of a tracking ritual, like a seance. And no, it's not dark. I got it right from the source. I'll put it back before Caretaker even knows it's missing. Hey man, we gotta try something. I mean, it has to be a sign, 
right? That all four of us had the same dream of Wanda? Oh, cool. Okay. So that's got to be the same as what we also had. Make that five. <laughs> you win. Ouija away or whatever. Lock the door. Remember, once we start, we don't stop. Keep your mind focused on Wanda. Ego, spiritus, add. Got it. What did I just say? <laughs> Do not break the connection. Okay, uh, sorry. Right. <sighs> this is how Atlantis sank. Ego, spiritus, add, may. Ego spiritus ad me. 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 Whoa! Anyone else see that? She said not to break the connection. Well, you just did. Ego spiritus ad me. Ego spiritus ad me. Ego spiritus ad me. Was that our fault? I think so. Disconnect. Pull the plug or something. It's too late. Spiritus ad me. Ego spiritus. Cool. Oh boy. Crap. <laughs> Where the hell are we going now? Couldn't trust those two to chant their own names. I am going to open a rift to the negative zone in their showers when we get home. If we get home, there's no telling where that screwed up spell sent us. This could be a broom closet in the basement of Dr. Doom's castle, for all we know. Or a storage nook on Galactus's world ship. Holding pen on a scroll cruiser. Oh, maybe the inside of Robbie's brain. There. Something powerful. Something strong. Something foul. That's where we begin. Ugh. Of course you were gonna say that. Explains the foulness. Ah, the illustrious hunter. And friends? Really? You still follow me on Super Lake? <laughs> Not ringing a bell. I can tear through the fabric of space and time itself. Huh. It doesn't matter. Let the fool prattle on. We must be on to something. I cannot fathom how you found this facility. But I will, soon enough. Your names may escape me, but you most assuredly will not. Oh, we will see about that. Oh, that's interesting that it just throws us in here. With the pre-made decks, we have no, like... Never surrender! Any control over that? She's injured. This facility appears in no records. Wow. On no maps. Not even in the minds of these loyal soldiers. Okay. So the question remains: How are you here? Just a little of the old abracadabra. No big deal for a squad of ultra powerful and well known heroes like us. That was awkward, girls. But that's fine. Okay, so uh, we're gonna take a pause here. And 
that'll probably be like the one episode that didn't have any combat in it, but I think for all of like Magic's party and Limbo and everything that was going down, I think that makes a lot of sense. And I don't recall if I don't recall if this is like a super long mission or not, but either way, uh, we'll stop here and we come back. We'll start with the combat and resume the normal uh, episode layout. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed that episode a little bit different. And uh, this one should be fun. We've got some scary enemies on the board. And uh, we haven't brought Nico out for a while. So thank you guys. Bye for now.